Yet a Cormedinian share, Ashe Henlishne, Nakai Bushachin, Kiani Dishiche, Nakai Dishanale. Um, hello, my name is Cory Medina. I'm from the Navajo Nation, uh, Shiprock, New Mexico, and I'm born for the uh, and I'm Salt Rock Clan. Any Salt Rock Clan in here? No? Oh, man. All right. <laughs> uh, like I said, I'm from New Mexico. I relocated to Bemidji, Minnesota uh, three years ago. So, yeah. Three years, is, um, three years this month I've been here. What brings a desert res boy to a winter wonderland uh, <laughs> is uh, Lord knows it take a beautiful native woman to get me up here, and it's uh, it's definitely been worth it. <laughs> Being from the reservation, you know, every, every community has its darkness. Every every uh, community has its. Uh, trials and oppression, you know, and, and, and being a little res boy, you know, and growing up with a single mom and dealing with drugs at such a young age and um, uh, depression and, and, and suicide, suicidal thoughts and attempts. And I, I found at a young age, it was, it, was, it was no matter who you are or where you come from, everybody has the blues. And I grew up loving the blues music because there was passion. I could, I could sometimes hear their hurt, you know, and, um, and, and, I, and, I, and I was just so drawn to it. And still to this day, that's why I do what I do, is to let people know that um, through my scars and through things I've been through that, whether I'm not proud of or I never want to go through again or I never want anybody else to go through, is that um, there's someone who's in that same spot that I can let them know, hey, I'm, I'm a walking testimony. I'm a walking 
miracle that I'm still here and I'm not in a casket or in jail. And to let you know that whatever you've been through, whatever trials you've been through, whatever oppression you've felt, that you're still here and that you got through and never be scared or ashamed of your scars knowing that um, you're going to help somebody else get through the same thing that you've been through. Uh, and that's why I do do what I do to sing music and uh, let people know that um, it's good to be light wherever you go because everywhere you go there's darkness. And the more we can become light in our communities, in our families, in our homes, the more this uh, world will can see you know, the true problems, the true priorities, the true good things in life. So uh, thank you for having me. This is a, I'm just a res boy from Shiprock, New Mexico, and this is really cool to be here. Um, I'm going to do this uh, next song called I Won't. And it's uh, basically blues of a lifetime that I've been through, that I've seen other people go through. Um, and that, you know, there's, there's, the, there's the, the ugliest sides of it where you just want to give up and you don't want to move on anymore. And you just say, I won't. No, I'm not going to do it anymore. I'm, I'm giving up. There's a 13-year-old girl up here who spoke to me, you know. Because I remember when I was 13, I was, I was a mess. But that's the time I uh, found true meaning in life. I found hope. Yeah, and no matter how hard times get, there's something out there, and everybody's something different. Some people it's music, some people it's family, some people it's God. But no matter what, uh, you're never alone. And that uh, as many times you want to say, I won't, there's, a, there's someone out there who won't give up on you. Thank you. 
Better days come in my way, Lord, I need to get through. But I don't know how, Lord, I need you, Lord. I need you now, cause I don't know where to go. Thank you.